Just a second, girls. Did you see that, Flopsy? See what? P Peter! In the trees! You are silly, Mopsy. Rabbits don't climb trees. They see! There! Ow. Really, Mopsy? Oh, dear. I meant to take the empty milk bottles back to Ginger and Pickles. We'll have to go back and get them. Come on, girls. Uh. Oh. Cotton tail! Now would be a great time to save the baby. I mean, if I wait any longer to jump for this icicle, it's going to be summer. <sighs> and then there won't be any icicles. <laughs> I've got to get up there. But I'm no squirrel. How will I jump that high? Well, there are a few things we might consider. Number one, we could try... Oh, never mind. Friends, I shall now jump to where no squirrel has jumped before. Why shall I attempt such a feat? Yes, because I'm a... Well, no, Felix, take that squirrel's name. Um, it is because I'm brave and heroic. No tail and I have very strong leg muscles. No one else would even attempt this jump. <laughs> Save the cheers for after I jump. Oh. You're okay. I, I promise I'll keep you safe from now on. Come on. Uh oh. Uh oh. Hop to it. Oh no! Your mum's heading home already. We'll never get back before them. Don't worry. A good babysitter never gives up. Follow me. Any sign of Peter? If I have to do this much longer, I might <laughs> drop something. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> No sign yet. <laughs> Keep going. Left a bit. Right a bit. Benjamin, get ready to catch the cake. <laughs> Ow! That didn't feel like a cake. Tail feathers! <laughs> Who did that? Rip Skelly and Rabbit Scruff! Grow faster! Oh no! Look! Come here. They don't look very happy! <laughs> Tail feathers! It's all my fault! Running around, blaming everyone, making them angry at us. Rabbits? I'm sorry. It's okay, Peter. You were just trying to get Cottontail's cake back. Well? I got us into this mess, and I'm going to get us out. But how? They can see us coming. Come we can't on, just disappear. Rabbits. Maybe we can. Lily, do you still have that leftover flower? Right here in my just-in-case pocket. You know, just in case. They can't catch what they can't see. It's awful foggy all of a sudden. <laughs> Right, let's get up, gotcha! Where'd you go? Get off! <laughs> yes! <laughs> Rotten rabbits! <laughs> what are you doing, you feathery oaf? I thought you were those rabbits! You must have let them escape! Pah, we let them escape! You're the one who was following them! You three are a bunch of... Bungling boneheads! Uh, At least we're not stuck like you! Uh, uh, I'm not stuck! I'm just sharpening my claws! <laughs> <laughs> Looks like we were all stuck! Uh, thanks to Peter, Peter Rabbit! Shh! I'm 
I'm sorry, Mum. I looked everywhere and I just couldn't find Cottontail's cake. Never mind, Peter. You tried. But how could that cake just have disappeared? It was right. Wait a minute. <gasps> what is it, Peter? <laughs> Cottontail? It was you all along? Ah, oh, my dear, you've already seasoned yourself with a little nettle. <laughs> How thoughtful and delicious. Leave my sisters alone. And why should I do that? Because uh, you never fit three rabbits in a pie. Everyone knows that. See? <laughs> Peter? Well, a fox mustn't be greedy much. Maybe I'll start with a Peter Rabbit pie. One more step. <laughs> <laughs> Let me out! I, I promise not to eat you! Much. Come on! We're still having pie! Even if Mr. Todd isn't! You did it! Yes, I did! No chance Mr. Todd will catch us now! No, we mean you found the gooseberry bush! Most delicious berries in the woods! Well done, Peter! Yeah! <laughs> Thanks, Dad. Couldn't have done it without your map. <laughs> See, Peter? That's what comes from being prepared. You didn't need your knitting, though, did you? <laughs> <laughs> You could leave me in a hole, huh? Hey! Stay away from my sisters! <laughs> uh, Gooseberry? Oh, why not? It would sweeten up my rabbits. Ah! Ah! Um, a little help? and Peter's gooseberries. What a delicious pie we'll have now. Thank you, Peter. Actually, I couldn't have done it without Flopsy and Mopsy. <gasps> oh, Grab my poor Mopsy! I'm really not enjoying myself. Mopsy's too scared to let go. I can't reach her. <laughs> Whoa! Flopsy! What was it Dad used to say? A good rabbit never gives up. <laughs> Rowdy rabbits! Uh, hey, ow! Uh, you leave oh, my sister alone! Oh, oh, tail feathers! Uh, ow! Oh, ow! Tail feathers? <gasps> oh, I did it! Hey, everyone! Help! It's okay, Boxy! Oh, no! Jump! You can do it! Whoa! Oh. Mopsy! Oh. Wow. Nicely done, oh. girls. Uh, Peter? Ah. Mm. Won't get away that easily. Coming up? Lily! Yes! yes. <laughs> this way. <laughs> Everyone! Rabbits! Hi. In there! Ah. <laughs> oh, oh. Oh, rabbits! 
I thought if we all put one of these on our heads, like armour, maybe it would... Uh... And everyone's gone. Oh, well. <laughs> yeah! Well, I guess all we have to do now is wait here until Old Brown leaves and then... <laughs> Nuts, kid! <laughs> <laughs> hey, what are you doing? Going home! I thought you said that shoot was dangerous. Please! We've just had a treetop battle with an owl. That's dangerous. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Ooh, ooh, yeah. <laughs> you know, maybe you two should come on more of our adventures. Oh, yes! There was this one time when we were being chased by Mr. McGregor and Mr. Todd and Tommy <laughs> Brown and Old Brown <sighs> all at the same time. <laughs> and it's a nice offer, but from now on, I think we'll leave the adventuring and the secret tree house to you and your friends, Peter. Thanks anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! Group hug! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> <laughs> We're losing speed! Forward, Benjamin! <laughs> That's quite enough! <laughs> Kindly stop this infernal contraption so I can eat you! <laughs> <laughs> Almost! Almost! Almost got you! I've got the mint. Now all I need is you rabbits and I'll have the perfect stew. <gasps> Benjamin, untie the rope. What? Wait, stop moving. We're not the ones moving, Mr. Todd. <gasps> <gasps> Ooh, that's got to hurt. Oh. Peter Rabbit. <laughs> Let's get to the burrow. Woohoo! Yeah! Woohoo! Whoa! <laughs> oh, we're here. Yeah, but Dr. Bobtail isn't. I have one job to do, Benjamin. Bring Dr. Bobtail back to the burrow. But somehow I lost him and Lily. I have to go back for them. No, you don't, Peter. Of course I do. A good rabbit never gives up. But, Peter, look! <laughs> Lily! Dr. Bobtail! Yay! Group hug! Whoa! Aww! <laughs> uh, now let's go and help Cousin Tail. Let's get you better, then. Open wide. Oh. Uh. Uh. Ah, ah, yes. I think I see what the problem is. It seems young Cottontail has... a toothache. A toothache? Oh, no! Is it serious? <laughs> no, no, Benjamin. Cottontail will be just fine. I suspect she just chewed a little too hard on something. I'd suggest some mint to soothe her teeth. Oh, dear. I don't have any. We never find any. Not in all this snow. <gasps> I know exactly where I can find some mint. Thanks, Mr. Todd. <gasps> Bye. I'll get you, Peter Rabbit. <clears throat> oh. Ta-da! Oh, thank you, Peter. <gasps> However, did you manage to find mint in all that snow? Yeah. It's easy if you know where to look and who to ask. No more hurty? <laughs> no more hurty! What do we have here? <laughs> Somebody else tag along today, did they? <laughs> you don't want my little sister, you want me! <laughs> Rabbit's hiding. Come out, come out, wherever you are. There's no way we can all get past Mr. Todd. <gasps> We're trapped! A good rabbit never gives up. <gasps> Peter, look who's back. Yay! Kitty Cat! No, Cottontail. Not yay. 
If the cat's back, that means Mr. McGregor's back too. And he's even more dangerous than a fox. I know that for a fact. Yes, that's it. We get Mr. McGregor to scare off Mr. Todd for us. That's right. We get Mr. McGregor to... Wait, what? It's easy. We wake the cat, the cat alerts Mr. McGregor. But how do we get close enough? We can't. But I bet someone small and super sneaky could get through that gap. <gasps> Want to play peekaboo with the kitty cat, Cottontail? She's doing it! She's doing it! Uh-oh! I smell rabbit. Ah! Uh -huh. Well, uh, you're pretty stinky yourself. <laughs> it seems our little game of hide-and-seek is over. Yeah, but Cottontail's game of peekaboo is about to start. Let me explain a little something about the natural order, young Peter. Rabbits are scared of foxes. Fact! That's true, Mr. Todd. What's the problem, Cat? But then foxes are scared of angry gardeners. Fact! Oh, what angry gardener? <laughs> oh! Mr. McGregor, stop there, you wee thief! <laughs> <laughs> I hope it works. This Almost is so ready. exciting. It's so dark in here. <sighs> Hush, Mopsy. <laughs> I have this funny feeling we should be holding snacks right now. You always think you should be holding snacks, Benjamin. <laughs> <laughs> is it ready yet? Uh, nearly there and, uh, ah, yes, here we go. It seems Mr McGregor likes to record moving pictures. I suspect he's been doing it for many years. <gasps> oh, it's Mr. McGregor's garden. What's he doing here? No, no, now don't panic. These are pictures taken long ago. Moving pictures. I don't believe it. What you found were the pictures taken by Mr. McGregor. It was just a question of working out how to show them. Wow, my dad is a genius. Oh, really, Benjamin? Huh? <laughs> wow! It's amazing, Mr. Bouncer. Yes, but, well, was there anything else in the pictures? I thought I saw... Patience, Peter. It does indeed seem that on occasion, Mr. McGregor would catch sight of something other than mere vegetables. It's him. Wow. Cool. Look, Flopsy. <gasps> this was a perfect day. How days are meant to be. A great adventure and wow. then returning home <laughs> to friends and family. Looking into the past, I find myself alive. <laughs> Standing on a bridge between now and then We are together again We are together again We are together again We are together again, are together again. Good old Dad Oh, you look more like him every day, Peter Another viewing? Why not? The 
Time to lose you, but be on your way. Journal was right. This is a lovely spot for a picnic, Mopsy. Would you care for a sandwich, Flopsy? Mm. <gasps> Don't mind if I do. Oh, jam! Hazelnuts would be much better. I'll be right back. Knock in! And I'll take this. Peter, huh? what are you doing here? Getting my journal back, that's what. Dad gave it to me. He was our dad, too. Hey! <sighs> Peter! Give it back! Get it back! Oh, it's ours! Oh, no! Peter, stop! Shh! You're making too much noise! <laughs> That's ours! Give it back! Maybe we should talk about this at home! No, Peter! Why do you want the journal anyway? Uh, to find the perfect spot for a picnic. See? What? Oh. Shh, Peter! These aren't picnic spots. They're places not to go. Because you might meet a fox. <gasps> or a badger. <gasps> or an owl. Fox? Badger? Owl? Shh! <laughs> yes, owl. Big, hooting, scary, sharp beak, sharper claws. Owl! Oh, oh, Peter. Peter. Shh! Oh, yeah. Right. Don't wake up the owl. Maybe he didn't hear us. Ooh, funny breakfast. Don't mind if I do. He heard us. Get down! <laughs> Blundering weeks. Ah, got you now. Peter, this is all your fault. My fault? You're the one who woke up the owl. You're the one who took my journal. Ooh. No! Ah. It's not your journal. <laughs> Go! We'll follow you in the boat. <sighs> Quick! Hey, Peter! Look what I found! <laughs> Hazelnuts! Oh. Mm -hmm. Yum! You really ought to try one. Look, Look out. out! What? They're leaving so soon! Ah. 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 